Nuts and Bolts Pro Tips, presented by Bushido Warrior Rod Blanks from American Tackle Company. Bushido combines the latest manufacturing processes and material advances to create the most focused, technique-specific blanks in the world. Now here's an application of the UniNot where it really shows off its versatility. I'm wanting to connect two lines together, but they're different diameters. I want to connect my 80 pound class braid main line here to my 80 pound class monofilament line. And you'll notice the monofilament is nearly twice the diameter of the braid. If I were to tie two standard uni knots making a double uni or a uni to uni connection, it's possible that the braid would slip through or even cut through the monofilament because of its small diameter. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna put the monofilament aside for just a second and create a doubled line with the braid. Pull a little bit out and double it back on itself like so. And then I'm gonna tie just a series of overhand knots. Make a loop like that. And then one, two, three overhand knots and pull it tight. There we go. Now I've got essentially a single piece of line here that is getting much closer to the diameter of the monofilament. And I can treat the monofilament as a piece of line and this doubled braid as a piece of line. So we'll start with the uni to uni knot and I always start with the monofilament first. Make the loop here and I'm gonna do three passes over the top of the braid and the mono. One, two, three. And of course I would lubricate this a little bit. Pull that tag end. This is heavy line here, so you have to work with it a little bit. And just start your knot. You don't have to worry about cinching it down too much just yet. Now, same thing here, I'm gonna take the braid and I'm gonna form my loop, like so. And I'm gonna go one, two, three passes over both the braid and the mono and pull that tight. Now the two lines, just like with a standard unity uni knot, will cinch together and the resultant knots on either side of each other are about the same size. So now this knot's gonna, the braid's not gonna slip through the monofilament, nor is it going to cut through the monofilament because of its small diameter. So I've created a larger piece, effectively a larger piece of braided diameter line to match this larger piece of monofilament here by creating a doubled line and I was able to tie the uni to uni. Again, a very strong connection and that knot is not going to come apart. <laughs>